Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to whip up a really easy minestrone with Pampered Chef's minestrone soup mix and our Rock Rock Dutch oven and the Rock Rock digital slow cooker stand. It is so easy to make this in a matter of minutes. So on those busy work and school days, you can just throw this all in, turn it on. And when you come home later, you have some delicious warm soup. So we're just gonna put in one packet of the minestrone mix. So it's got all of your herbs and spices in there already. And then we're just gonna add our water. And of course it's our easy read measuring cup so that you're not trying to juggle. You just pour this in here. Now it calls for four cups of the water. And that's why I'm doing it in the Rock Crock Dutch oven because that's a bit deeper. So it's really great for soups and stews, chilies, roasts. And then you're just going to add two cups of chicken broth. Now I'm gonna add three because I am throwing this in all together now on the slow cooker setting so that it goes for a few hours. But you can also do this on your stovetop and just um, cook your pasta separately, throw it in and it's ready in about 20 minutes. So you would just uh, get the soup base to um, a boil and then simmer it while you're making the pasta and then you can throw in your pasta and your beans and everything else. But since I'm gonna cook the pasta in here, I just wanna have a little extra liquid. So I've got my broth and then I am just throwing in about half a cup of those little teeny pastas. So not the ditalini, but the little ones. And then I'm gonna throw in some beans that I've already rinsed and I've got just one package of the um, bird's eye mixed veggies. Throw it all in there. I'm gonna stir that up nice. Make sure everything gets mixed. And then I'm just going to throw the lid on and turn it on to low for about three hours. And then it should be nice and ready for dinner. So how great is that? You can also cook it on high and get it going even faster. And of course, don't forget your silicone straining ladle. So you can get the strainer on one side and just the regular spout on the other. So you can get that perfect ratio of liquid and your um, pasta and veggies to every bowl. Maybe make a nice warm bread. Try the Italian herb bread. It is delicious. Nothing like having warm soup and warm bread freshly made on a cold winter's night. I hope you enjoyed this and stay tuned for more.